But I do want to ask, I have to ask, do you think, you know, withdrawing from your 401k, so there's a 10% penalty for that, right? And your 401k was already down and you took a loan, so you can take a $50,000 loan on it and then you withdrew, did some withdrawals. Do you like 10 out of 10 recommend that for people? I think it depends. It depends on your situation, your mindset, your, you know, willingness to, to take a shot on yourself. I'd like to say I bet on myself. Um, so this is a different kind of foundation where I was 21 right out of school. I think I graduated on a Friday. I was at work on a Monday. I put the max in since I was what, 21 years old. Um, I'm 32 now. So I, I'd been maxing it out to, to the best of my ability wow. it, it, with the company match. Um, so I had a significant amount kind of had saved up over time. So it does work and it is, you know, ebbs and flows of it. I just got to a point where I was like, I got to, I got to do more. I got to better myself. I want to grow this. The way I look at real estate specifically is it compounds in a different way. So you can 1031 your way up. If you want to go bigger, um, you're, you're doing that loan pay down. So that's appreciation loan pay down where you get more equity. And then, you know, for us selfishly, like, we can use it too, which is great. So now we can take the family up to Maine or New Hampshire, which is really cool for us. 